In one of my earlier videos, I showed you how to bypass and reset the password on any Mac. This can be extremely useful if you ever forget your password, but that same method can also be used by a thief to access your computer. In today's how-to, I'm going to show you two ways to prevent this. The first method uses your Mac's built-in disk encryption tool. Head to System Preferences, click on Security and Privacy, and then click the File Vault tab. To enable File Vault, click the lock icon in the lower left corner and enter your admin name and password. Then just click the Turn on File Vault button. If you ever need to reset the password on your computer, you will be able to do so using your iCloud account or with a special recovery key. However, you will have to store the key in a safe place because if you forget your password and lose the key, all of the data on your disk will be lost. File Vault will begin to encrypt the files on your drive after you restart your computer. This method will keep your files safe, but someone could still erase everything on your computer by going into recovery mode. To prevent this, we are going to set a firmware password. You will need to restart your computer and when the gray screen appears, hold the Command and R keys at the same time until you see the Apple logo. Click the Utilities option in the top menu bar, select Firmware Password Utility, and click Turn on Firmware Password. Now you're going to want to enter a password that you won't forget because if you do, you'll have to take a trip to your nearest Apple store to reset it. Once you have entered a password, click the Set Password button and restart the computer. The next time you or anyone else attempts to boot into recovery mode, you will be required to enter this password. For more how-tos like this one, be sure to check out howto.cnet.com. You can also reach out to me on Twitter with any questions or comments. I'm Dan Graziano for CNET. Thanks for watching.